and welcome back to Girl Scout Helper. Today we are going to be talking about some things you can do to earn the out to help your girls earn the outdoor art maker Daisy Girl Scout badge. For this badge, there are three steps. One is to see the colors of nature, two is to hear the sounds of nature, and three is to share your outdoor art. For seeing the colors of nature, I have a um, scavenger hunt printable um, in the description below. Um, the scavenger hunt is simple for daisies to understand and is also in color so that they have a, each co a color for each thing they're supposed to find. So they are going to find um, something from F, uh, of everything in the colors in the rainbow and that kind of shows them to see the colors of nature. For hearing the sounds of nature, you can take your girls on a silent walk within your community or where you are meeting, which could be at your hiking trails. Just take them on a walk, tell them not to be quiet, and they can uh, relax and hear the sounds of nature. Listen to them sounds of nature, everybody. Three is share your outdoor art. So for this one, I do have a really cool craft that we're going to be making, and it involves the porcupine principle I have linked down below, and some leaves and some glue. This is a great opportunity for you to remind your girls not to pick up leaves and use uh, that are on plants and to remember their leave no trace principles. Just go on a simple walk and you'll, sure, you'll, you'll be sure to find some leaves. Okay guys, so I got my um, porcupine here as well as my glue that I'm going to be using and my bag of leaves that I collected on my leaf walk. That's what I'm going to call it. So next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to glue on top of where the spikes are to add the leaves as spikes. So let me just get out my leaves. Some of them at least. I'm going to break off some of the stems. And then I'm just going to attach them to my porcupine to give him a nice little spike that are leaves. So just like this, I'm gonna take my glue, kind of just put a strip of glue on, and then attach it to my porcupine. Then I'm going to do another leaf. Then I'm just going to continue doing that with all my leaves. Here's my leaf porcupine, everyone. It's not dry yet, but this leaf porcupine can actually last a decent amount of time, although it does feel like it's going to fall apart. I gave one of that I made in the past to my grandpa, like eh, about a year ago, when the rest of, when the daisies and my Girl Scout troop were able, made them, and I made one as well with them, and that's where I got the idea for this. But anyway, I gave it to that, him, and it still is there. Like all the pieces are still on it, but some of the leaves obviously did die because it's been over a year. I added this cute little yellow leaf as a nose. But I think it looks super cute, and this is a great thing you can share with your family and friends to show them of all those cool things you can make using uh, outdoor art. Alright everybody, I hope this video gave you some good tips and tricks on how to help your Daisy, uh, on how to help your Daisy Girl Scouts earn their outdoor art maker badge. I'll see you guys next time. Don't forget to comment down below if, uh, if you have any specific badges that you want me to show some tips and tricks on how to earn. See you guys later. Bye.